Hi, this is David from PhoneBuff.com and today I'm going to be doing a video on how to switch out your keyboard. I just downloaded the Gingerbread keyboard from the market and um, I'm going to show you guys how to actually activate this guy. If I can hit the home key. Alright, um, you can see that I just installed it and uh, what you want to do is you're going to hit menu and then settings. And from the settings menu, let me zoom in for you guys so you guys can see. Um, you're going to look for something along the lines of language or keyboard. Depending on your model of phone, it's going to be different. But something similar to that, or close enough to that, should I say. So you can see there's uh, two keyboard options, really. There's a gingerbread keyboard and the touch input. This is the HTC Sensation, so that's the Sense keyboard, um, which is currently activated. You can tell by if I hit search, you can see it. All right, anyway... I want to activate the gingerbread keyboard. So the way I'm going to do that is hit that check mark, hit OK. And um, what you'll notice is though, a lot of people run into this, they'll think that that will do it. They'll hit something and pop up the keyboard and they'll notice the same old keyboard comes up. So what are you supposed to do at this point? What you have to do is long press. So find that empty text field. So at the very top, it's an empty text field. I'm going to press and hold, and uh, you can see that little pop-up, and it's, the pop-up is going to look different on your phone. This is Sense, so it shows up like that. Uh, on other phones, it's a little rectangle or a box that shows up in the middle of the screen. So anyway, you're going to hit Input Method, and you can see it's on Touch Input, which is the Sense keyboard. I'm just going to hit Gingerbread, and voila. You've got the uh, gingerbread keyboard up and running. And this works with any keyboard. And if you want to switch it, same idea. You're going to be able to actually do it from right from here. Instead of having to go through the settings, you just hit input method, touch input, and there you go. The reason why I went to the settings first is for the gingerbread keyboard, you have to first activate it for some reason. All right, but that's pretty much it. This is David from phonebuff.com. Don't forget to visit phonebuff.com for more cell phone news, reviews, and how-tos. Thank you.